Good morning. I hope you guys are having a great day. It's bright and early, uh, but it's time for the 2019 Bassmaster Classic in Knoxville, Tennessee. If you're new to the channel, I am Steve Chapman of Fishing Florida Radio, and uh, we're going to take you on a little trip with us today as we uh, drive and meet the anglers and do all sorts of stuff. You'll get an and behind the scenes look at the, the classic from a media perspective and a, you'll get to see a bunch of anglers, a bunch of pros, the expo, everything. It's going to be a great time. You'll be here with, the, I'll be taking you with me on this little adventure and uh, I hope you enjoy it and we hope you enjoy it from Fishing Florida Radio. So as I sit here and wait in my neighborhood, look at this, for my ride. That seems to be a little late. Here we go. Let's do this. Yo. Good morning, good morning. Good morning. Bright and early. Right on time. <laughs> Where are we going? Knoxville, Tennessee. Bassmaster Classic. Gotta love it. It's Les and I, the dynamic duo. <laughs> okay, <laughs> say goodbye to him. Goodbye, guys. Well, we're here, and uh, we're getting our media badges. Maybe we can say hello to some people. See what's going on. Right there is our boy Brandon Palinick. So we're here to get our media badges, and then we're going to walk over to the boat area. Maybe do a little sightseeing, see if we can see anybody that we know. So stick with us. Got the badge. But what you're about to see is the most expensive parking lot ever assembled on earth. And by that, I mean, check this out. I don't know if you can see behind me, huh? Because I've been told we'll be run off, but back there is Kevin Van Dam. He is in, in his boat doing an interview. I don't want to bother him, but you never know. Here's A.A. Ron. I'm sure he won't mind if I go talk to him. Especially when he finds out that he isn't with, with Boudreaux tomorrow. Looks like they're getting all the bags ready. Getting everything good to go and ready for the 2019 Bassmaster Class here in Knoxville, Tennessee. It's going to be something special. Is it the last Bass Classic? We're going to find out. He's on the phone. You don't bother him when he's with his wife. <laughs> We're late. What time? I don't know if you can see that in the back. Mike Iconelli. I'm not supposed to be filming him today. However, I went over and talked to Mike. I talked to Jacob Rosnick, Kevin Van Dam, and Aaron Martins. All of them say, if you're not catching a few smallmouth this week over here, you're in trouble. One to three one to three of those fish that the five fish are going to bring in is probably going to be a smallmouth. Water has dropped drastically. It's dirty, but look for a crankbait 
Mike is going to be using a DT something. Forgot already. Shoot. <laughs> You're getting old. Uh, but it's blue and yellow is what he's going to be using mostly. A spinner bait and uh, a, another Rapala DT that's gray and white. I'll try to find it while we're on there. Kevin said the same thing. Crankbait is going to be the, the key bait. And Aaron said he's just having a hard time and to leave him alone. <laughs> Shortest answer you ever got from Aaron. Yeah. Kevin, I helped Kevin put his uh, his tarp over his boat and he told me uh, he was looking forward to fishing. Jacob Prosnick said the same thing. He's They're ready to go. Jacob isn't going to the dinner tonight. I have no idea. Boycott. Oh, what's interesting here is the elite anglers. Yeah, they'll have a half page. Then for the classic. Oh, they got a blurb. Yeah. They just. They give us a. That's on the 2019. A media thing. We're not allowed to be here. Do you know that? Yeah. Did you get kicked out? No. I just. Uh, I didn't know where you were and I was. I just there. pretend like I own the place. Right. But the most expensive parking lot in the world is right here right now so we're gonna head back to the hotel but Maybe, I don't know what else we'll do grab something to eat grab something to eat but tomorrow you'll see media day so be prepared um, get your fish on take a kid fishing and what else be safe out there catch fish do work do work later <laughs>